the camera. We're gonna write your receipt for while you're down here. Oh, I'm taking it to the clerk's office. I'm sorry? I'm taking my camera to the clerk's office. Okay, yeah, you wanna step aside, I'll get my supervisor here and then uh, we'll go from there. He wants to go to the county clerk's office. Okay. Why are you videoing? I'm so confused what you're doing. Oh, I'm just taking pictures of the county clerk's office, that's all. Well, why, are, why is it on me? I'm not part of the county clerk's office. Well, you're talking to me right now. Yeah, you have color. to go to 14 to get clearance and they give you something to come to the different offices. You just can't come start recording. Why? This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is, but you can't oh, come. Oh, yeah, then we're good. Yeah, this is my right not to be on your camera. You don't, you don't have a right to yeah. use a person's license. So I'm asking you to leave again. You guys work for the government. We, we do, but you're, you're our quoting, likenesses do not belong the to the government. How you doing? What are you doing here today, sir? Um, taking up. photographs in the publicly accessible areas, that's all. Okay, I don't think this is a publicly accessible area. No, she out said, here is. She no, said out it is. No, out here. here. This is out a private office. You just said that this is a publicly accessible area. No, this is their private office. Listen, y'all. These kids want to act up in school? Want to go to school and embarrass you? Want to make like they got no home training? So I told my son, don't go to school and no more. I take care of you, son. I give you anything you want. I discipline you. But you're going to embarrass me like this? You know, so now I'm going to cut his hair. Oh, I got to ask you. Hey. 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 Now I saw you were in a restricted area. Now I want your right on the You're not getting it. Don't embarrass me. I told him, don't embarrass me. No down here today in Syracuse, New York. It is September 8th. We are here at the Onondaga County Courthouse in, court, in uh, County Clerk's Office. And next to it here is the Civic Center and County Offices. So obviously we're here to do a little civil rights investigation and make sure they respect our rights to video record in public. And uh, with no further ado, let's get in it. This building is exquisite. Beautiful architecture. I'm not sure if we can get in them doors up here. Let's see if everybody's going in this way. I'm sorry? I'm taking my camera to yeah. the clerk's office. Okay, yeah, you want to step aside? I'll get my supervisor here and then uh, we'll go from there. Uh, all right. Yeah. Okay. Good? Yeah. Okay, if you want to step to the side, I'll have a supervisor. All right, Erie County fam. This Onondaga County office visit was three hours in length. I'm going to cut a lot of it down and put it into possibly two or three parts, depending on how I can edit it up. But it's right off the bat, they thought they were going to check our camera and violate our civil rights off the bat. And we are not having it, fam. So hold tight. Here, get me through here. Or wait oh, we can get you through. I'm going to have the whole line of the camera until the supervisor comes up and makes a determination of whether you can bring it in or not. Well, I wouldn't have to go into my I'll let the supervisor dis discuss that with you. So, your body cam, you can set everything right in here. Anything metal, foil, electronic. He wants to go to the county clerk's office. Okay. So, he doesn't want us to receive his cameras. 
see what my captain wanted to do for the process, you know. But you're all set. This building is so special, huh? Yeah. Um, so there's two different entrances. There's one on the second floor on this side and then one on the opposite side. Is the DMV here or is that a separate building? That's a separate building. The only thing we have here is the county clerks. Look at that building. So this is the county clerks. And then they have another entrance on the other side for other parts of their office. All right, cool, thank you. All right, you're welcome. Records in here. I don't need help. Pardon me? I don't need help. Okay. Put columns in here. Everything is just absolutely exquisite in this building. a little water damage or something going on there. Seeing no signs here, saying no cameras, no photographs and documents. Even the woodworking up here is extravagant on the shelving and casing. This is definitely one of the most gorgeous 
county clerk's office as I've ever been in. Can't take apart the books. Oh, thanks. Pretty standard procedure. Another sign here. Let's check it out. You guys do You guys are a private company or you guys work for the county? Private company. Private company, so we survey company in this. Yep. You guys rent space here? Yep. Monthly, yearly, or whatever? Yearly. Yeah. All right, thanks. That's all. Pictures in here. Yeah. You were here. Yeah. I I couldn't even. I thought you were the Burn Mary. I was in Burn Mary. I could get all power was out. Oh yeah. You? I was at gymnastics. Um, but yeah. Definitely nothing here about uh, little photographs. Watching us, make sure there's no problems. Some pictures of these documents. No problems. Me? No, I'm just taking a look around, taking some photographs of the office. Is the county clerk here in this office, or? Oh, she is. She's not in yet. Not in yet, so. Uh, but she will, she will be in today. All right. Thank you. Oh, I'm just taking pictures of the county clerk's office, that's all. Well, why, are, why is it not me? I'm 
I'm not part of the conflict. Well, you're talking to me right now. Is there, I mean, in terms of county clerk stuff, do you need anything? Or is it no, I'm all set. I just helped myself to a couple photos of a story I'm working on. I'm just a journalist. What's that? The, the building is probably one of the most gorgeous. I've been in a lot of county clerk's offices. You guys are very lucky to have such a beautiful building. Yeah, they don't build them like this anymore. No, definitely not. It's probably cost a mint to build something like this today. Yeah, the flooring, the, the, the pillars, the ceilings, everything. If you compare this courthouse to the new courthouse across the street, it's like... Surely have air conditioning. Why you guys don't have AC in here? No, we have AC, but it's an old, it's an older building. It's just not as good. Yeah, the infrastructure. I mean, you can see some of the plumbing issues we have. Yeah, I seen there a little water damage or something happening there. Yeah, that's a gorgeous building. Yeah. Like a lot of stuff is historical. Like we used to have the Civil War flags in here, and like if you go across the hall, it says County Court. Now they moved County Court out a while ago, but it's historical. So they keep the same thing with our Judgment Department, um, the woodwork and stuff. Not allowed to touch it for good reason. And your name is? Oh, my name is Malcolm Mel. Malcolm? Yep. My name is Dan. Dan, hi Dan. I'm just an independent journalist. I just taking some pictures for a story I'm working on no and problem. That's okay. do a little civil rights investigation as well. Make sure there's no no camera signs in here and stuff like that. That's all. A lot of uh, counties uh, like to say no cameras in the records room because they like to make the money to, for the records. Yeah, I mean, but well, I mean, our, our records are, you know, we got our records online. You know, Most of them are online. Yeah, yeah, I mean, our, our foot traffic is so low now. I mean, people can... You know, Digitize it all, huh? Yeah, you know, oh yeah, we're working hard on that. Yeah, a lot of, like, the title companies, they don't rent space from us anymore because they can do their work from home. It's a, you know, and same thing, you know, if you came down to get a copy of your business certificate, and your deed, and then come downtown, you know, get hit with parking, you know, for parking, and you're inconvenient to your time. The only thing they're going to miss is this beautiful building, I guess. Oh, absolutely. No, it's but man, it, absolutely. this is probably one of the most gorgeous county clerk's offices I've ever it been really in. It is, you know, and I want to say maybe 10 years ago, um, they were even more than that, because I think I, well, they wanted to move us out into like the CLB and stuff, and we, you know, well, one at the time, there's so many books have been impossible, but... There'll be a lot of, it's, it's lot of books to move. <laughs> yeah. Well, like I say, we're working on scanning this stuff, you know, but um, we thought we get rid of the books. Yeah, we, actually, our, our book binder had retired. Um, well, he we actually passed away recently, but we used to have a book binder, a Italian book binder that would, you know, rebind those books. So, you know, someone that really knew how to take care of them and, re and rebuild them. How long have you been working here? I've been here, I'll be 27 years. Wow. 28 in uh, November. That's pretty cool. Well, it was nice talking to you. I can let you get back yeah, to work. Any and questions? Yeah, come on back and feel free. All right, thanks. Hey, no problem. Have a nice There's more clerk's office across the way here. Okay. You said the legislators on the seventh floor? West lot. Fourth says, floor is the county ledge. Ledge? Yep. But we just say you don't film inside the courthouse until you get to the county ledge. Alright. Well you know the, the court laws, right? 
You can't film inside a courtroom or the hallway thereof or court office or the hallway thereof. So as long as I'm not in any of those spaces, we're good here. I've got my supervisor coming back. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I'm very, very familiar with the court law. The court law says you can't film in the courtroom or the hallway thereof. Right. Or so the these court are office or the hallway thereof. I mean, like the stairwell obviously is the hallway thereof. Yeah. yeah. So once we get up to this floor, obviously, I'm just gonna ask you to stop recording until we get up to the uh, county ledge. I can't film around this corner. Huh? No, because this is all courtroom area. You can't just keep. You know, yeah, if you. Yeah, that's. Yeah, that's Come right around the corner here, up the stairs. I'm not trying to break any laws, of course. I appreciate it. But I don't know why we'd want to you hide this to exquisite building. And then I'll just ask you to stop recording here when we go to past the court chambers. It's this way? Yes. This is the room we want to get in. Where the lights are in here. I'm just a journalist trying to get some photos of the county building where I can in this building, obviously, with the courts and that. But um, okay. I was looking to get some pictures of those county chambers. Yeah, sure. God, how yeah. do I turn the lights on? I'll get them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, yeah, it's an old school way. Yeah, sure. Sounds like a little switchboard. You got to flip the switches, huh? Oh, yeah. And your name is? A lot of them. What's that? What, what's your name? Debbie. Debbie, and you are here? What's that? Well, your position? I'm the assistant clerk. Assistant clerk to the yeah. legislature? All right, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. This is on the Diagle counties. With what media group are you with? Oh, uh, I'm independent. I'm with myself. Oh, okay. I, private. Just to get some working. pictures for just. Yeah, for a story I'm working on. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you. Good old and God we trust still on the building. Some stuff here in the cabinet. This would be the section where the people would sit back here. Jeez. Oh, 
This is all the legislators from the districts. Even these desks are pretty extravagant. Go ahead and get a shot from up top where our chairman would sit. They got a chairman and chairman here. This is what he would see during a county meeting. Unfortunately, I can't say how the whole county is going to do, but I do can say that the court staff was a little uneducated on our constitutional rights. They tried to check our uh, camera up the top, but we weren't going to let that happen. So I can't smack the gavel today and say well done or not well done, but we'll give her a tap and uh, we're going to have to check out the rest of the county building before we can make the judgment call how they all did down here so county meeting room again with the woodwork and gorgeous array in here Pictures of all the previous administrations. And that's our county chambers down here in Onondaga County. They sure don't make buildings like this anymore. Thank you very much. I'm all set in there. You want to shut the lights down? Okay. Thank you very yeah, much. Awesome room, isn't it? Oh my god, this building is absolutely exquisite. Yeah. Was that a courtroom at one time? It, I think it was yeah. back before the legislature. You know, but we've been having sessions in here. You know, it's funny because we're working on some sessions that date back to 1930s. Nice. So 30s and even before that, 19, you know, 15 and yeah, pretty, 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 uh, pretty lot, a lot of history, I should say. Yeah, modern buildings never get exquisite treatment like this. Probably cost a millions and billions of dollars oh, to build a building like this. Rebuild this. Yeah, it's hard to, it's hard to maintain it. We were just uh, showing, you know, we got a couple ceiling things that are coming down. We are showing our repair guy, you know, it's hard to fix it. Yeah. It's old ceiling, you know, but yeah, marble floors, it, they don't look the greatest, but you know, they're old. <laughs> yeah, they did it's it one time. Can you replace it? Yeah. So, okay, yeah, no problem. Thank you. That's a great picture. Let's see. Old, uh, old picture, yeah. mm -hmm. chamber. Getting out of there, got a chance to see the exquisite building and all that down here in Syracuse, downtown. We'll go ahead and get over into the Civic Center, right next door here. That's the Rat and And uh, make sure they respect their rights throughout the entire county box building. So this place definitely has no heads up that we were coming. Um, the uh, probation department definitely did not call my head on this one. This is the John H. Mulleroy Civic Center. Let's go ahead and get inside here.
a door for you. How we doing? Pretty good. Good. to focus on the screen meshing. Risk management down here. Not sure exactly what risk management does. View from up here on the 16, 15th floor. Yeah, what goes on in risk management in the county office? Like, what do they handle here? Uh, internal insurance and whatnot. Are you looking for someone in particular? No, I'm just an independent journalist doing a story on the building and uh, taking a tour through the publicly accessible areas, just, you know, seeing what's available for the public. But I don't know, or risk management on a county building. It's um, basically insurance. Insurance that the county has in there. It's not my area, actually. I mean, I'm walking in this door, but I'm in financial operations. Gotcha. They're a very small segment of it. Oh, is it is back there? Yeah, there's like two employees in there. Yeah. But gotcha. They're, no, I don't they're un, help. They're un, unrelated to financial operations. Well, yeah. my part of it. Anyway. Yeah, I don't need help. I'm just, just taking some photographs. <laughs> Pictures of the building for a company or something? Oh, uh, for myself. Some, oh. Something I'm working with. Okay. Looks like that's about it on this side. I actually don't need any help. I'm just here to take some photographs. For? Uh, a story I'm working on, a journalist. Okay. I may be wrong, but I doubt it. I like that. Can I help you, Tom? No, I don't need any help. What is it you're looking for? 
Oh, I'm just taking some photographs of the office. I'm not really looking for for myself. For what purpose? Um, I'm gonna disseminate it to the public. I'm a journalist. From where? Um, I'm a private, independent journalist. What's your name? My name's Dan. Dan. Dan is all I give up when I'm out working. Um, your name is? Jim. Jim. Mm-hmm. You the office manager here? Or? No. No, I don't need any help. I'm just taking some photographs of the publicly accessible areas and what's available for the public. Yeah, I don't need any help. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. There's a view of the old courthouse from up here. Out of Syracuse from up here. Nice, nice view. Old maps in that cabinet, it looks like. Like this, walked right outside. Break room back here. Not too much going on in there. I don't actually need any help. I'm just here to take some photographs of the office, what's available, like the pamphlets and stuff. Uh, a journalist working on a story down here on the Dahlia County. Um, um, give me one second. Let me get my boss. Can I help you? Um, no, I don't actually need any help. Why are you here? What are you doing? Uh, I'm just taking photographs of all the public inf information on the walls and uh, offices, what's available for the public and disseminating uh, it to the public. You have to go to 14 to get clearance and they give you something to come to the different offices. You just can't come start recording. Why? This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is, but you can't oh, come. Oh, yeah, then we're good. Uh, can you call security? Yeah, I don't need any help or to talk to nobody. I just... What's available? As a matter of fact, can, this thing that says tenant rules, is that like something I can get? Uh, you have to go downstairs to, and get clearance first from 13, from personnel, and then they'll have you come up and they'll give you... She just says um, publicly accessible up here though. Um, so you have to go down to 13 and get the clearance and then you can come up. 413. I can't have any of those pamphlets back there. Kalei, can you come out please? I was just seeing if I can get one of these uh, public information up on the wall here. That's all I need. Which one? 
The one on the corner says ten inch rights guide. Let's ten see if I rights. yeah, if I can get one of those booklets. Yeah, is, yeah, can you turn your camera away from me, please? I mean, I'm, can you please turn your camera away from me? I'm I'm not going to know. Okay, so then I'm not gonna give you one of my pamphlets. I'm gonna have to have you go downstairs to thirteen. So can you just grab me one of those pamphlets? That's all I need. I'm out of here. That's all I needed. But you could have gotten that. I don't the want to be on your recording, so I'm asking you to well, leave out. You guys are because public employees. This is constitutionally protected activity. Okay, I'm asking you to leave. I'm not asking you not me. to put me on can, camera. Can I please just have one of those tenants' rights? You can pamphlets? have. Yes, you can. That's all I was asking for. Well, you didn't have to bring in your camera to do that. I mean, we're asking you not to have us on film. Thank you. I understand you're asking, but you guys are public employees. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. This is constitutionally protected. Individual rights. Yeah, this is my right not to be and on your camera. You don't not have a right to yeah. use a person's life. So I'm asking you to leave so again. You, you guys work for the government. We, we do, but you're, you're our quoting, likenesses do not belong the law. to the government. Yeah, if you're quoting the law, you understand you can. I can. Arbitrarily use a person's public likeness in any respect. There's no, there's no such thing as privacy in public. Here's, here's the thing. Saying. So you understand copyright law? Copyright laws? Yeah. Do you understand copyright yeah. law? Like, for example, your name and your likeness is assumed your personal copyright. Yeah, but you guys waive that when you become a public no, no, employee. No, no. There's no waiving. We waive nothing. You could actually sue me for using your likeness or your image in any respect without written consent. You should research that. Not when you're in public, though. You should research that. It doesn't matter where you are, you should research that. I think you there's, the there's one who no needs time. to research there's it because no I do time. this for a living. Okay, there's no time at all that a person surrenders their constitutional rights. What constitutional rights to privacy do you think you have? You don't think you have constitutional rights to privacy? Absolutely not. Not in public. Yeah, sure you do. There's case law. As long law, as man. what you do doesn't harm anybody. Case law does not supersede constitutional law. For as long as what you do what, doesn't what harm What constitutional anybody. amendment gives the right to privacy in public? Because the first amendment... Or, does the you, exact opposite. Here's the thing. For as long as you're not causing injury to anybody, you can move around in public all you want. Right. But it's when you cause injury. Am I you injuring do, you? No. no. Well, well then I'm good. You don't have to be confrontational. I'm just explaining to you what the law is because you're saying you study the law. Well, I did too. So what I'm saying to you is, as an individual, as an individual, and you can go to any judge or anybody else to confirm as much. For as long as what you do publicly doesn't cause injury, then you can engage and move around as much as you want. When it causes injury, you are in violation. Well, right? So you're right. Law. For example, a right is not a right if it infringes on the right of another person. You understand that? Yeah, but what so right do you, you, you don't have a right to not be recorded in this office in so publicly accessible areas. You have a right to not be recorded in any respect if you ask a person no. not to. No, that's incorrect. It really is. I'm not. I'm yeah, not trying to be difficult. I'm just yeah. saying that's incorrect. No, you actually. You can't just say it's incorrect. Quote how it's incorrect. You tell me what law. No quote case law, because case law, case law doesn't the, supersede the constitution. First, the law. First Amendment of the United States Constitution is freedom, freedom of speech, of press, right? freedom of religion, and freedom of the press. I have the freedom of the press. That's why I'm allowed to be here. Freedom of privacy. What's that? Enumerated in the Fourteenth Amendment. Fourteenth Amendment There's doesn't Yeah, here personal right autonomy there. law. Hi. How you doing? What are you doing here today, sir? All right, Erie County fam, let me introduce you to Deputy MacDonald, the most irritating, condescending, unprofessional jerk-off of a deputy we will run into in this building. She thinks she has God's gift to the uniform and that her stuff don't stink. Boy, let me tell you, this lady is irritating. Um, taking up. photographs in the publicly accessible areas, that's all. Okay, I don't think this is a publicly accessible area. No, out said, here is. She no, said out it here. is. No, out here. here. This is out a private office. You just said that this is a publicly here. accessible area. No, this is public their private office. Yeah. This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is. No well, she ago. said it was a publicly accessible area. This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is. No well, she ago. said it was a publicly accessible area. So, this so that's, that's I'm wrong. This is the lobby. No. No. See how the door shuts? That means yeah. that it's a private office. It's okay. You, you can see, how this is, see how this is green and it's not locked? Sir, it's for a proximity card, okay? Yeah, Do you have business in there? Then you can make. No, 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 no. That's not, not how this works, it's though. Not locked. But that's not how this works. It is how it you works. You can talk to somebody at the front desk or you can make an appointment. You're free to make the an appointment. The lady literally said it's publicly accessible in there. I'm telling you, she's wrong. This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is. Now, fam, if anybody in this office would know whether it's publicly accessible or not, it would definitely be the chief diversity officer, the one who runs this office, who we just heard from say that it was a publicly accessible office. Now, Monica Williams would definitely know 
whether it was or wasn't, and she said it was. Now all of a sudden they wanted us out, and this officer will continue her condescending attitude, unprofessional, undeserving of a badge, or to uphold her oath to the Constitution. This lady is a total disgrace to a badge. And we all know why they removed me from this office. It was because of the camera. It certainly wasn't because this office is not publicly accessible. We, after all, we just heard the chief executor of that office tell us it was. Tell you she's wrong. Tell you she's wrong. What? Okay. This is what it is what now. What can I do for you today? I, I don't need your help. Okay. They're the one who called you. They need help. They said that someone was in their private area. So no, there's not. All. There's definitely not a private area. Well, I don't know if you're an authority on that. See how she uses her card? It's not for you. It's but for it's them green. to conduct their business. Man, it's green. That doesn't mean that you're welcome in there right now. This gentleman is waiting to be seen. You see how that works? He has an appointment. He's waiting to be seen. That's how it works in an office building. But you're just it here to film. Say, is it, doesn't that say, it doesn't say authorized personnel. It doesn't personnel. have to, though. It does. What can I do for you today, it though? It does, though. It doesn't. I don't need your help. Okay. I just know, don't go in there, I know okay? where I'm allowed to be. Okay, but not in there. You can be right here. I, I was already in there. And I know, and it's that's publicly why they called me. She told but me. But that's why they called me. No, they told you because they think... Yeah, but they People think... People are not always 100% percent People right. are mistaken okay. in there thinking they have privacy in public here, too. Yeah. This is public right here. You're free to film in here. Okay? No one's stopping you. Okay. Hey, Jason. What's going on? Can I get your, your badge number? Uh, my badge number um, is... Okay, so just... Yeah, just 3401. I just I need think the available funds. McDonald's? Oh, so that's the yep. only thing I think of that, and I'm just, I'm, I gotta run down to Steve right now, but then I'll talk to... What's your name? I don't give it. I know. You like your privacy. I just don't, I don't understand. This is uh, publicly accessible. She says publicly accessible. Now they want their privacy in public and they're gonna no, no, you, try to remove me. Nobody removed you. You removed me from that office. So you didn't remove me, so I can go back I in. So I can go back in. No, that's a private office. You can be right here. This is so you didn't remove me, but I can't I go back in. Well, you heard it first, fam. This trash deputy McDonald's just asked me to leave because you guys know I would just leave a publicly accessible area because I'm I'm not being pushed out by a deputy, a trash deputy, after being told that this was a publicly accessible area and a door shut behind me because yeah, I would leave on my own free accord. You know, I left because um, she asked, not because she put her hands behind me and shoved me out the office. Yeah, she she didn't force me to leave that office, right? What do you guys think? Yeah. Okay. That's the definition of being removed. No, I was asking you to leave. We're all set out here. It's all good. Okay. We'll just hang out here because it's a public area. Right. Is 3 eight coming? No. Can I get your name? Yep. C L I S S O N. That's how you spell your last name? That's how I spell it. Right. Yep. Can I get your badge number? 1227. Right. Thank you very much. Yep. What's your name? My name is Dan. I understand. What's that? I'm sorry. I said my name is Dan. Dan? Yeah. Hi, Dan. Nice. Pleased to meet you. Yeah. Huh? Ridiculous. Oh. <clears throat> you don't need the phone. There's no reason for it. Hi. They're gonna see about that broken door. Oh, it's broken? Yeah. I think it's uh I'm pretty sure when they're it's red. Typically locked. I'm sure it's when typically they're locked. Red. So they're just gonna get it fixed so it's I'm locked. Pretty sure they're when they're yeah. red. Yep, yep. It's called do notice. There's no do notice on that doorway that says do not enter. There's no do notice like a locked door handle. Publicly accessible areas are publicly accessible. It, you know, there's no do notice that says it's not. It says visitors checking at the front desk first. Right. That's it doesn't say do not enter without an appointment. There's no do well, notice. I guess it's just a polite sign. Well, the polite thing to do is follow the law and give due notice. And stop at the front desk, yeah. This trash deputy thinks she's so smart but if you read the sign, it says all visitors must stop at the front desk after entering the door. 
So if you were to stop at the front desk that she keeps pointing at here like she thinks she's so smart, would you enter the door, then turn around and leave and go to the different department and then go back inside for permission to be in there? This deputy is so condescending and such an idiot. She thinks we're the dumb ones. Boy, what do you guys think? Please, please leave a comment in the, in the comment section about Deputy Mac Donald here and her smartness. And she thinks she's so hot. You know, like if I needed to speak to somebody in there or talk to somebody in there, I would need an appointment. All I want to do is take some pictures of the pamphlets well, and get a pamphlet. That's all. They have the illusion that they have a freedom to privacy in there. They don't. Unless they're in their personal office. Like, I didn't go in that lady's office. I didn't go behind the publicly accessible areas. I know. I guess we just have different perceptions of publicly accessible. But they'll make sure they're garlots from now on. Yeah. So well, thanks for bringing do, that to our Do notice is definitely, do you know, no needed. Yeah. Well, Erie County fam, that's it for part one. But don't worry. Part two is still packed with a lot more cop calling and educational moments here in Onondaga County. I'll give you a little taste of part two now, but past that, I'll have to see you on Wednesday. So make sure your bell notifications on and you're subscribed because on Wednesday, it's about to get a lot hotter here in Onondaga County and the education is gonna roll. Hey, Chris. Hi, who are you with? Uh, I'm with myself. I'm with myself. You're not allowed to film in two that was a private hearing room that you were here to film. I was, just, I was in the public, I was in the private area. Yeah, this waiting room is public, but yeah, you can't film was. into, there's a hearing pre preparation starting there. And that's, it has access to the public in case clients need to go in. This is our executive deputy no. commissioner. Can you please put the camera down? Oh, no thanks. No thanks, so you're leaving the building? What's that? You are leaving the building? No, I'm not leaving. Have you seen the signage on the doorway when you came in? In here? Yes, there's a sign on the door. That is their request here, that there's no it's audio video. It's for the privacy of the people that are filling up. I was up told paper. I can film in here, though. Not in here, not in this floor, I'm sorry. I don't see why not. Is that a law, is what I'm asking? I don't know if it's a law or not. I can't say that, but it is the Department of Social Services, Sarah Merrick's regulation on this floor, that there's no recording because of the privacy of the information. The public is allowed in here, though? Public's allowed in here. Well, no well, audio and video. Stop it. No audio video though. Yeah, I'm sorry. In order to do that, I would say why don't you go on up to the county law department All right, possibly. So here's the next question, since you guys yep. just want to say it this way. If I video record this lobby, are you going to arrest me? No. Alright then. Dan, no, but I'm Dan, people have privacy. I will leave this would area. You not want I will leave if this area if you guys threaten to yeah. arrest me for video no, recording this area. We're not gonna threaten you, we're trying to talk to you. Morning. Can I help you out? No, I need any help. I'm just grab some photographs in here. For who? Uh, myself. For yourself? Yeah. Just to sum my work on. Yeah, so that's not authorized. Why? Could you come with me though? What's that? Could you come with me though? No. It's, I mean, I could send somebody. Public, is the public allowed in here? I could send somebody questions? to ask you. No, I don't, I don't need any help. I need help. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. This is an unauthorized access area for you. Go that way. Why for me? Go that way. Is the general public? Don't touch me. Don't you touch me. Go this way. Get your hands off me. Go this way. This guy's putting his hands on me. If your camera's running, you have access to it. Anyways, you have to have authorization from facilities. Did you get authorization from the 12th floor to be doing all this? Did you? I don't need permission yes, to be do. recording here. You do. You guys, maybe you need a supervisor from down here. Maybe you Let's need to turn it off somewhere. first and then we'll talk about it. Let's Let's talk about definitely not turn this off. This guy just assaulted me. You guys gonna do anything about that? If I assaulted you, first you of all, be speaking to anyone here, man. First of all, you wouldn't. That's right, fam. Part two is gonna be more fiery than part one with some more hands-on and deputies that don't know the law. So make sure that you subscribe and then bell notifications are on because when part two rolls, there's gonna be some fire footage guys so hit that subscribe hit that like share and i'll see you guys in a couple days we live in a society now where people want to record how they discipline their child people that might get mad with this video is the people that probably already embarrassed their child you can't you can't discipline your child in their room
take something away from them. If they act up, well, I'm like, son, you can't play the game. This is not publicly accessible? Yes, it is. Really said it's publicly accessible in there. I'm telling you she's wrong. I don't have anything to do with it as far as following the Constitution. You pull the Constitution out of your pockets out here. Like that was supposed to prove something. First Amendment, freedom of the press. Your name is not Dan Erie County. Um, this isn't Erie County. Yeah. Sure it is. On here is Dan Erie County. Legitimate? Maybe. Official? No. <laughs>